Hey everybody, I am here to start a new haul. Um, I had a couple things come in and a couple things that I'm needing to use, so I wanted to get this filmed and get another haul started for you because this week is Thanksgiving week, so I am going to be shopping a little bit for Black Friday. So anyways, I'm just gonna get right into it. First is a couple printable items. Um, I'm just gonna probably keep these like in a normal haul. Um, but anyways, so I have two kits here. The first is a kit from Planner Pixie Co. This is Magic Christmas. Um, I ended up getting a, a couple printable kits to use in my pre-planning inserts, um, just cause it's nice and it's a little less expensive. Like it's a cheaper alternative. Um, but I'm still able to use more artwork because my Christmas is jammed full. So this one is a very primary color um, Disney Christmas kit. So here are the full boxes. And as you guys know, I used one of these kits recently and I love the format of this. Um, and I just love, it's very unique looking so um there is the little heart checklist i love these um some washi strips bill do some heart checklists and then like weekly trackers this sheet has rounded half boxes these little scallop boxes daily trackers some bow little boxes here weekend script uh headers or not flags and then the canceled rescheduled and then here is some like stitched half boxes fancy labels more of those scalloped in these little check boxes the bottom washi this is a fun bottom washi i love the little pattern of this the date covers another full box um, the deco, tons of deco, these decorative scripts here, and like just some functional deco here. And then I also did print out the extra fashion girl sheet um, just to kind of play around with it. I wanted these square boxes, I love these. And then the checklist flags there, um, glitter headers, and then these like just generic icons. So that is Magic Christmas from Planner Pixie Co. Let me know if you guys like seeing my pre-planning um, videos. I know I posted one. Um, anyways, but this is the pre-planning kit that I'm using for this week. I'm a little behind. Um, so this is from Planning Choco. This is an older format kit of hers. Um, I think it's from a year or two ago and it's pastel Christmas. I just love this artwork. So I was originally actually going to use this for my normal Thanksgiving spread. Um, some fashion girls deco bows. I didn't print off all the sheets of this because again, I'm using it in my pre-planning inserts. Um, the boxes, half boxes, quarter boxes, fancy labels, appointment boxes there, glitter headers, um, the, the weekly ch checklist, daily checklist, dildo stickers, and then these three heart, three bow checklists. Um, the functional items here, I love these long flags. Super pretty. And again, a very basic color scheme, but... Um, I love the pastel and this artwork was super cute. So those are the two printable items. I did get an order in from Sticky Essentials. Um, I got another one of the, I'll show this first, the header overlay grab bags. Um, so it did come with a rose gold uh, hollow, a silver, a sparkly hollow, and a gold super satisfied with these super excited i've been having fun playing around with those i did swatch them um 
so the new silver one I got was the sprinkles which is nice because I have the sprinkle full box overlays um, the sparkly hollow I did get this like crosshatch kind of plaid pattern then for the hollow which I think is my favorite it's this like real um, wispy line design super pretty and then for gold I as well got the um, sprinkles again super cool because I do have the sprinkle overlay box and then for the rose gold I did get the sprinkle as well so lots of sprinkles in this one but it's nice because again I have the sprinkle full box overlay so super excited about those and then I did get one kit I got her full kit this is the holiday chic kit um the funny thing about this is um I'm actually funny enough is I'm actually pushing this until January which I was like worried about that but I'm like you know what it's my planner and I want to use this kit so bad but I didn't want to push any of the Christmas kits that I had planned out um so yes this is a very boho style Christmas kit um I got the 15 millimeter washi strip um and I did get matte I thought I got glossy hmm, I don't know um, so I did get matte. So I got the 15 millimeter washi strip. These full boxes are to die for. I absolutely love them. This full box scene, the fireplace, oh, this gift, just everything about this is just gorgeous. So it's been a while. I haven't seen, I think, her new format full kit because I use some in the summertime, but they, I think they were an older format. So, the, sorry, I lost my train of thought. So, some part checklists, the sidebar checklist stickers, headers, the weekend script, and then some circle icons. So many boxes. Um, I love that. I love these little square boxes. They're super fun to use. Um, rounded half boxes, fancy labels, and then, then some washi strips, little things, and then like just some plain ones that are little thing size, and then the rounded quarter boxes, work boxes, more fancy labels, um, flags, the hexagons, movie marquee, some checklist, and then the daily habit trackers. I love that the glitter headers come in the kit. Um, extra full box here and just some little quarter square boxes there and deco. I just love the whole scheme of this kit. And then the bottom washi date covers and then another extra full box. So that is everything. Just a small little haul here. Um, but like I said, I will be ordering some Black Friday items. Um, so those will come in and I will add them to this. So I will see you guys in the next part. Okay, so I am here to do another haul portion. This is some printable stuff that I've been working on. Um, I told you guys I was going to do the printable stuff in normal hauls. So we'll just get right into it. First, I have some Happy Bee stickers. Um, she does doodles. And stuff like that I really adore her stickers so I did pick some stuff up so I got her reading set so it comes with the currently reading boxes and then you have like the open books the little bookshelf just some different varieties I thought that would be nice and useful for school I did get to the meeting ones just for the, I think I'm gonna give these to my daughter for like her meets for school. Um, so they have these little computers that say meeting at, and you can write in the time. And then I wanted them for the little phones. So you get different shades of phones there, super cute. Then I did get to the, I think this is called the junk food, but it had different varieties of food items so there's fish and chips sandwich pizza ice cream 
um, onion rings, donuts, the cheeseburgers, hot dogs, chicken nuggets, the little drinks, the fries, and the chicken. Then I did get the taco, like the Mexican one. So this has the chips and salsa, burrito, um, guac, the little avocados and chips, and then it just repeats itself. And then you have the taco and taco night ones. Then I did get this one. I think this is a breakfast. So this sheet has different coffee items. Um, just different variations of the coffee and then I got it simply for the egg ones because I thought this is super cute and I eat eggs a ton so you got like eggs on toast um just the over easy eggs eggs in a pan the little heart eggs and then just um some more repeating stuff there then I did get the pumpkin um themed set so this has pumpkin pie just a bunch of pumpkin desserts here and like pumpkin pancakes um this one has just pumpkins on it like a pumpkin coffee just different variations there i did get the thanksgiving sheet um so like different like deco pieces here um and then you have all the food items so you have the turkey rolls um like pumpkin soup fruit, uh, pumpkin pie, and then pecan pie. Then I did get this one. I love the pastel Christmas. Um, so you just have presents, like a card, ugly sweaters, Christmas tree, ornaments and stockings, the little angels, and the snow globe. And then also with this set, it came with this one. So the Christmas planner, um, the Christmas drink, the Santa mug, the candy canes, the gingerbread, and the sweets in the jar. And then I did get to the Christmas boxes as well. Just some different styles of boxes here. I love this artwork. And then these little Christmas sticky notes. And then these are like um, scenes. So this one is a snowman scene, a shelf with like the Ray Dunn and the gnome, some hanging pictures, and just repeating there. And then these are like little dividers. So you have the string of Christmas lights, the gnome with the poinsettia, um, and then the ornaments. So that is everything that I picked up from Happy Bees on Etsy. Okay, so next shop is Planning Choco. I have used her kits before and I've shown them before. I did get my two monthly kits from her. So I got a January and a December. So first up is the January. It has this really pretty Aurora artwork from Kittenish Girl Jess. This one is called Aurora. Um, so it has the top um, items, the numbers, the strips, flags, and then the second page has like the sidebar strip or no I think that's like like if there's a strip missing like below the month and then we have some boxes here some icons um some little boxes here this is a very functional kit for me um it is very useful and I kind of looked and struggled to find one that would fit for me so more boxes some bill do boxes some flags these little square boxes some deco pieces and then finally you have your choice of sidebar which i'll probably just do the deco sidebar with the fashion girl it's absolutely beautiful but you do have the checklist option as well i also did get december after seeing this i'm really sad that i didn't use this artwork because it's super pretty um this is called dear santa same layout here super pretty and this letters it's just everything about this is just absolutely gorgeous super fun and then the sidebar option depending on how it looks i may use this sidebar but who knows so those are my two monthly hits from planning choco um, the next shop I have is Planner Pixie Co. I love her kits as well. Um, so I did pick up a spring kit. 
a little early but she did have a sale so I wanted to pick this one up this is the spring horizons so um, it's the like pastel Animal Crossing artwork um, so it comes with the quarter sheet of icons and date numbers the glitter headers um, it comes with a quarter sheet of work boxes and school boxes as well so here are the full boxes this is just so pretty I think this is Darcy Dubow artwork if I'm not mistaken I just the colors just spoke to me I really like it and then we have the heart checklist boxes um, some of the trackers bill dues I love these little checklists um, I just love her style of kit it's very unique looking to me but it's very functional as well then we have um, some stitched round boxes some scallops these bow labels um, daily trackers, the canceled rescheduled weekend script, and some flags. Um, then this page has the deco, some script, like functional script and functional deco. I love her font as well. Then this, we have more of those scalloped boxes, um, the stitch fancy labels, and then squared off half boxes and these little check squares. The bottom washi, which is split into two, which I love. Um, the date covers, an extra full box. And then this is the extra sheet. It comes with these really pretty scalloped like looking clouds. Um, checklist, like scallop checklists. Um, more of the script, more basic fancy labels. And then the fashion girl with some square boxes and some scalloped boxes. So that is the kit from Planner Pixie Co. And then I did end up getting three kits um, for one of my new favorites is White Rose Printables. Um, so I knew I wanted to use this artwork in one of my open spots in January. This is the Aurora artwork. I think that's what she called this kit. Um, and it's just gorgeous. Um, very functional layout. I love her kits. Um, full boxes we have the scene here I love like food flat lays and like just the aurora borealis kind of thing I think that's what it's called um is that what it's called uh northern lights I don't know <laughs> um and then we have the glitter headers some headers fancy labels and then some plain washi strips all of the boxes which this is perfect I love it and these colors are just gorgeous. Um, little things, pattern fancy labels, patterned washi. The extra full boxes and the tall boxes, which I'm struggling. I really kind of do want to go with a frozen, like I want to use the frozen boxes because I do like that theme. And then you have the deco. The heart checklist and then some work boxes. Um, weekly trackers, some squared quarter boxes, checklist flags, regular flags, canceled and rescheduled, some teardrops, and then daily trackers. Then we have, I have a cat joining me. <laughs> Baba, what are you doing, dear? Come on. Come on, baby boy. Okay, there we go. <laughs> um, interruptions. <laughs> so there is the large flags. Um, these are like little thing size, but they're blank. Movie marquees, some scripts, and then some circle icons there. Um, more of the rounded boxes. Another work box they'll do. Um, the flight labels, and then the quarter boxes, the squared off. Another full box. Um, date covers, and then the bottom washi again. It's cut. I think you have the option to pick one piece or the split and then the weekend script, more flags there. So that is the first kit. The next one is the Blast Off artwork. Again, I think she called this box Blast Off. <clears throat> um, this is just beautiful. I just love the color scheme of this and the theme. I'm going to go through this quickly. Same layout. 
I just, I adore this layout. It's just great. If you guys love doing printables as well, as much as me, um, these are some great shops. Some of my favorites featured here. Then the checklist boxes, more boxes. I do really like using these as well. And then the bottom washi, the bottom washi is stunning. Okay, so the last kit I believe is called Hera. Um, this is using, this is an older format kit. She used to be called Sab's Planner Prints. And this is the um, more like grown up Hercules artwork. Um, so I just had to get it. It's very beautiful. So this has smaller icons here, um, some weekly trackers, the movie marquees, flags, um, daily trackers, less boxes in this format, um, the glitter headers, and then some glitter fancy labels, some glitter quarter boxes, and then some squared off boxes, headers, plain um, fancy labels, plain washi, the heart checklist, the work boxes. I love the gold glitter accents in this though. Little things, this has like the hydration tracker, um, patterned fancy labels, some more washi, the girl box options, which are gorgeous with the deco. I love it so much. <clears throat> Scripts, more icons, canceled, rescheduled, daily trackers, couple boxes, the teardrops, um, some rounded boxes, they'll do the work box, the flight label, and then some of those squared off quarter boxes, and then the bottom washi date covers and an extra box and the weekend banner options. It's absolutely gorgeous, I love it. So this is definitely gonna go into my spring kit lineup. So I have Lots more coming in from Black Friday and everything. I think I have like nine more orders coming, which is insane. But um, I will see you guys in the next portion of this. Hey guys, I am back for another haul bit. Um, this is probably the biggest chunk of my Black Friday stuff. Um, has come in so I just wanted to get it done and to try to get it put away. Um, I have Simply Gilded, Scribble Prince Co, Caress Press, and Coffee Monsters Co. I do have another two Caress Press orders coming in and a couple other random orders so you guys will see those before this gets uploaded but we'll just get started. I'll start with the Simply Gilded. Okay, so first up is Simply Gilded. I ordered during her, um, it was called her gold sale. And it was, I think, the Wednesday before Thanksgiving. Um, and I used to be obsessed with Simply Gilded. I had a giant collection. I bought every release. And then when I ended up getting rid of my collection, there's nothing really spectacular that I thought I needed except for this. So I'm gonna show you guys the freebies first. I got a bow uh, label and then this little stickler, sticker <laughs> sampler sheet comes with the journaling card. This is her terrazzo design. She did have um, those released as well. And then these really pretty leopard um, heart labels. And then I did get, I think this is the freebie if you placed an order. Um, this is a black washi with like a shattered glass bow, which this is super functional for me. Super glad to have that. Um, she did do some of her past sub box items and I saw this gold perforated washi. Like it's perforated like the header overlays. Um, but it's just solid gold and I thought that was super functional for my collection and I wanted to try her perforated items out. So picked that up and then I picked up the tone on tone bow bundle. So first it came with the pink, which I hope my lighting does it justice. It is just very subtle, very beautiful and I just loved the way that it looked. 
then you have the black tone on tone, which I doubt you're even gonna be able to see this, unfortunately. But same thing, but this is the most subtle. It's just tone on tone. Let me see if I can unwrap this at the end and see if I can see it better. And then there is the white as well. The white is super pretty too. So let me see if I can like unwrap this and see if we can see it better. Okay, so that is the black. You still can barely see it. Um, but in person, it's really pretty. It's again, very subtle, but I was super excited for this. So that was everything from Simply Gilded. Then I have my Coffee Monsters Co. order. Um, this was before Black Friday. I just needed to get some holiday character stickers. So first you have the bean card. It's this really cute Halloween design. This is the freebie. And then first sheet I picked up was the reindeer onesies. Super cute. I thought these would be super functional for like me time or sleeping in, things like that. I got these vacuuming emojis. These ones were super cute. They're the hormonal and I just like the Hulk and like they're crying with the tissues. So accurate. Then I picked up the iced coffee. This has been my life lately. I love the little emoji floating around in the coffee. I got to the Halloween critters. I just love the way that these looked and the cookie monsters are super cute. Then I got the festive night. It has the um, ugly Christmas sweater in a cup of hot cocoa, listening to music wrapped up in a blanket, and then uh, it looks like Santa listening to some music. Then I got the gift wrapping. Super useful. And then I got the Christmas working. So it has like all the different characters. You have the reindeer, Santa hat, Grinch, the snowman, and the elf just on the computer. I got the Christmas sampler in the bright colorway, which is just a lot of fun, different Christmas ones. And then I also got it in the pastel colorway because I did have a couple pastel Christmas spreads that I was doing. The movie night, um, Santa hat holding the popcorn in front of a Christmas movie uh, with the laptop and then the Christmas hat with the movie marathon. The festive gifts, this reindeer one is my absolute favorite. And then these are just some random ones. This is a backup for the Sweet Stuffy Dreams. I love this sheet. The online classes. I think this is a newer sheet. Thought I picked that up. The winter mug doodles. Super cute. The holiday treats. Has the cupcake, the gingerbread, frosting a cookie, and then the emoji like in the batter. The holiday beanie and scarves. I thought these again would just be fun for the holidays and winter time. And then this is Christmas Mug Doodles Part 2. So it has like the Santa mug, um, the to-go cup, the Christmas, or the Christmas tree one, the reindeer, and then the ho-ho-ho mug. So that was my little order from the Coffee Monsters Co. Next item is my massive Scribble Prince Co. order. Um, this is probably the largest order I've ever gotten in. She had an amazing sale um, and I stocked up on foil and wiggles because I love her wiggles and I had had my eye on a bunch of them anyways so I thought I would pick them up then. So I am just going to show you 
the easy the easiest way that I think that we can do this is just going by group. So the first thing I picked up were the matte black with a different foil colors. Um, if you guys watch Chris, Kirsten Plans on YouTube, um, she works at SPC and she's been using these on her sidebar. Um, the bow headers and I just thought that they looked spectacular so I picked them up in gold hollow rose gold and silver for the black and I will show you guys what comes in this is not like a normal wiggle it does have different sheets so the first sheet is the headers then you get the date covers you get two sets of those, the um, flags, and the bows, the circle icons, and then the bottom washi. So I did, like I said, I got those in all the foil colors just to kind of play around and see how I like that. And I think all of her wiggles, um, <clears throat> that were already marked down. I think these were marked down to like $8 before the sale started. They were an extra half off, so they were $4. So, couldn't beat that. Um, the next is I also did get the white variation as well. So, the white I picked up in the gold, silver, rose gold, hollow and then for this one I did get the sparkly hollow so let's look at the rose gold I think it's the exact same sheets um, but we'll just go through it anyways so the headers the date covers the flag and bows the circle icons and then the bottom washi so exactly the same as the black So I got those, again, just going to be excited to play around with them, especially for that price tag, you cannot beat it. And then the next is, let's see, I got two of the rose gold. I believe that this is the chunky glitter wiggle, again, these were all Mostly all the ones I got were $4. Um, so this one comes with the corners. This is an older style wiggle. Um, the circle icons and the date numbers. Header overlays. The full box overlays. The cutout icons, flags, weekend banner, and just some like little deco here. And then the bottom washi. Like I said, I got two of this so I would have enough full box overlays for a spread if I decide to use when I decide to use rose gold so that is the rose gold so next one I got is the magenta twinkle I got two of these as well because I think it's the same deal um, this is an older style so it ha it doesn't have as many like it only has one sheet of full box overlays so it has the corners the circle icons the glitter header overlays the full box overlays uh this mixed sheet here and then the bottom washi so again same format as the rose gold i don't really probably even need to be opening all of them just to show you the colors but I forget I think some of them are some different formats so then next I have two of the silver this is the exact same as um, the magenta it is the twinkle format with just one of the full box overlays so again I got two of those I got one of the I forget what they call this but it's the it's like um, sparkly hollow, but it's in gold. So I picked that one up as well. And finally, the last 
regular one I got was the gold. This is the gold twinkle. I did pick up three of the gold twinkle because I don't have a ton of gold. So I thought that this would be a good basic to pick up three of. Okay, so then I have some single items that I purchased. These single items were a steel. Like, I think the full box overlays were like 40 some cents a piece which is insane. So the first is I got the Christmas overlays that, uh, let's show you the, the rose gold, you'll probably see the best. Um, it says Merry Everything and Happy Always, and it says it's the season to sparkle. And I got all four foil colors um, just to have. Again, I don't know what foils I'm using for most of my Christmas kits for the rest, so we'll just see. And then I got the cutout icons in the three core foils. These are one of my favorite items, so I had to pick those up. I think those were like, again, like 40 some cents or something crazy. Um, and then I got her Celestial. These are the old format um, overlays. Um, I got the core foils again, so I'll just show you the rose gold. It says, if you be my star, I'll be your sky. And then it has this moon overlay. It has some glitter headers here and then some like deco bits. I also got the large cutout icons in four foils. So gold, silver, rose gold, and hollow. Next is the like Valentine's Day overlays. And this says, and suddenly all the love songs were about you. You will forever be my always. You make my heart happy. You are the best thing that's ever been mine. And again, I got the three core foils for those. And then I only got one of these because I am using gold with my um, New Year's Eve spread. So it says time to drink champagne and blow bubbles. Life is a party, dress like it. Won't you pop? the fun don't stop and then cue the confetti so I picked those ones up and then last I picked up the regular circle icons in all three foil colors again because one of my favorite things to just have is a staple and then the last two things I had are ginormous these are her foil bundles these were an amazing price. They were $40 and it was an extra 40 per, or 50% off of that. So I did pick up the core foil. Um, this one just came with silver, hollow, and sparkly hollow. Um, so I'm just going to go through it quickly with you guys. Um, this, I'll go through one, I think. Yeah, let me go through this silver one. So it came down to $20. So that makes each bundle like $250. So it comes with the deco bits, the food doodles, the circle icons and the date numbers, three sheets of the full box overlays, header overlays and half cut headers, the cutout icons, the script sampler and then the bottom washi and this is I believe the confetti format in silver and then I'll just quickly go through the rest of them because they're all the same like sheets but just different colors so this is the twinkle in hollow the heart in silver this is her old heart format the star in silver the star in sparkly hollow the confetti in hollow the um thin bow and this is in sparkly hollow as well if you can see that and then finally, the thin bow in hollow. So that was the core foil bundle. And then the next one was the fun foil bundle. Again, same format, like same sheets, but just 
different colorways and designs. So the first one is this little sequin red and it is in the twinkle format. This looks like a disco ball and it's in the chunky glitter format. This is a very pretty blue color and it's in the twinkle format. This color is just not picking up great on my camera. Then we have the, I think this is Lavender Hollow in the Thin Bow format. This is like a purpley blue actually, because when you hold it up to like this blue, it's definitely like purpley blue. But this blue is the star format and it's like a sequined hollow blue. This is like a shattered glass in the star format. This is a pink hollow in the star format, which is gorgeous. And then this last one is a um, sequined rainbow hollow in the twinkle format. So that was everything from SPC. Never thought I would get through it. I am going to be stocked up for foil for forever. Okay, so first thing I'm going to just quickly share with you guys um, from Caress Press is I did get a bunch of her new overlay tapes. I will insert swatches and show you guys, um, but I did get like the bougie boxes and the three core foils. Um, I got her new like pixie in all five. I'll just have to, like I said, I'm going to swatch these, but these are the full box options that I picked up. And then I also did get a few styles of her 15 millimeter washi overlays. Um, I got the silver bow, rose gold bow, and then the three core foils of her new pixie. Um, again, I will insert a clip of all of these swatched for you guys. And then I got a ton of the... As well, I got two sets of header overlays as well. Um, so again, I will insert a clip of all these swatch because these don't look like anything here, but I just wanted to let you guys know what I picked up and what you will be seeing in the next clip. Okay, so as promised, here are the Caress Press tapes all swatched out. So here is the gold. Um, so there's one with the like bow confetti, um, one with a more twinkle, the bougie boxes, then the headers. These are actually the simply gilded perforated headers and then the gold bottom washi. I'm just going to go through these quickly. Next we have the rose gold. Same deal. Um, also have the bow bottom washi for that. Now we have the silver. What's nice about her full box overlays is there's actually variation. So it's not just the same ones, but I just put the first one on the roll out for you guys to see just a little bit of what is offered. Then I have the hollow. Just a couple options here in the hollow. And then I do have a couple for the sparkly hollow. Hopefully you guys can see that. So there is the swatches of the Caress Press tapes. Okay, so first up um, from other items from Caress Press, I got two of her mystery foil bundles. Um, first one is this pretty blue. I think this is the November. Um, so this is what comes with her mystery kit. So you get four full box overlays, four more full box overlays, the header, um, the scripts, bottom washi, the bow, and these little hole reinforcers. I got this to maybe because I did get the November mystery kit to use with it, but I don't think that I like um, the way that it looks together, so I don't think I'm going to be using it together. The other one I got, I think this was October. It is a gold hollow, like sparkly pixie. I don't know if it'll pick up, but it's super pretty. 
excited to have those. Then I did pick up some regular foil items. And this also has my freebies in it. Okay, so these are all freebies. So this is her normal freebie. I love that she does foil freebies. This was a 75 plus freebie. This is in gold. This was in gold as well. Then I got a regular freebie in silver. She must have threw in this overlay box. I think I have one of these. It's in the sparkly hollow. It's a quote box. And then I got the 75 plus freebie in silver and the 150 plus freebie in silver as well. <laughs> and then I got a ton of the heart items. So I got the header overlays in the heart style. So I got the core foils, gold, silver, rose gold, and hollow. I got two sets of the full box overlays um, because two makes one spread. So I did get, again, the core foils, gold, silver, rose gold, and hollow. And then I got one of each of the heart bottom washi. I love how dainty her heart is and it looks delicate and beautiful. Super excited for it those. And I didn't pick certain colors because again I don't know what foils I'm going to be using with what spreads. So I did get three kits. Um, so I'm going to take them out of the bags and then I'll show you guys. Okay so I got all of my kits in glossy. Um, the, this first kit is her largest kit because they were sold out of the one that I normally get. Um, but this is the October mystery and I'm going to use this for my anniversary, dating anniversary because I just thought it was super, I think it works super well. Um, because our first date was at the movies. So it is absolutely beautiful. It's just like this backyard movie night theme. Um, and the colors are just really, really pretty. Nice and muted and kind of vintage looking. So the sheet has the deco, the circle icons, heart checklist, flags, and then functional deco. So many types of boxes here. Patterned and solid. More boxes, bill do boxes, and then some headers. Glitter headers, um, some solid headers here, these square boxes, patterned washi, the headers and the little things, work boxes, class boxes, um, three heart checklists, some functional stuff here, movie marquee, some weekly checklists here, um, some of the checklist boxes and a heart checklist, the ombre heart checklist boxes, the bottom washi, I love this little box. Payday, date covers, date numbers. And then this is the Fashion Girls. And I also picked up the 15 millimeter washi strip for that. So that is called Movie Night. It's the October Mystery Kit. I did pick up the hot chocolate. I thought that this was super cute. Um, I just love these food flat lays and the girl with the whipped cream, like accuracy. And I just, I don't know, I just love it. I'm just gonna go through this quickly with you guys. I love the splash of green in here and like the sweater patterns. Super good. And again, this is a smaller kit, so it does not come with ombre heart checklists, which it, it's fine. This is this normal size that I usually get. Little things. get then this functional sheet and then the bottom washing I love this little extra box I also got um, I think these were freebies with it so some extra box options and I did pick up the 15 millimeter washi strip lastly is my Valentine's Day kit um, this is Be Mine. I just love the way that she did this artwork. I love the animal boxes, the bed scene. It just really came together nicely. 
and this just screams Valentine's Day for me. I love the classic colorway and the papers are just super fun. I love this like red with the white hearts. I'm really having a hard time getting these apart. <laughs> Super excited for this one and the bottom washi is fantastic as well I did pick up the 15 millimeter washi strip and I accidentally ordered two <laughs> so um, okay so that is everything for this portion again I will have another smaller portion with my last orders from Black Friday coming in so I hope you guys enjoy this one see you in the next part okay hi guys final haul bit um, everything came in except two orders, but one of those has been MIA for like, like five days. So I just want to get this done and up because a lot of this stuff is like really old. So I just, I'm going to throw it up, be done with it. So first thing I have is an order from Once More Love. This is from her five year anniversary sale. And I picked up some staples that I needed to stock up on. And I also picked up some holiday stickers. So first is the freebies. So the first one is her Christmas holiday freebie. Super cute. I love this like tree snuggling one. So cute. Then for like certain orders, you got die cuts. So there's the little gingerbread the one holding the lights with the Santa hat, the mug, and the winter hat, and then the five year. And this was the first time in all the times that I've ordered from Once More With Love that I actually remembered to put Super Oops in the notes at checkout. So these are what I got. So the first one is just like a little strip of her anxiety sheet they're perfectly cut like I could still use this whole row I would just have to kind of like trim it a little bit and these ones are all usable so and then we have the zombie 2.0 I have been wanting these stickers um and it's just cut weird on the outside I don't see anything else wrong with it and then these ones are the um Winnie the Pooh and again I don't see anything wrong with these maybe they were just discontinued so those were my super oops from this order and then now on to the stickers that i ordered so these are the family feast one of my favorite stickers um i just really like using these for family dinners get togethers things like that i got the family cuddles which this is so cute then I got the sneaky shopping spree. I didn't have a whole lot of like shopping, like just generic shopping. So I picked those ones up. These are one of my favorites. The couch potato munchkin. I just, I adore these, they're so cute. And they're so perfect. I needed another one of the I had a bad day. Again, we all have these days. Just a staple for me. I picked up the Payday 2.0. I don't have um, anything like Payday related. So I thought these were super cute. I got the Sick Day 2.0. I didn't have a whole lot of like just generic sick stickers. Um, so I went with these ones. And then I needed another sheet of I forget, I think I might have the Coffee Monsters Co. birthday ones. So I picked up her birthday sheet because these are perfect. Then the Munchkin Mail, which I thought this was super cute, even to like mark other mail. And then I got the Boop sticker or the Boop sheet. I thought this was super cute. And it just kind of reminds me of my husband even though it looks like just too it's gender neutral you guys know that these are one of my favorite stickers the phone in bed i just 
I adore them. And then these ones I've been meaning to pick up. They're the dumpster fire ones. So just to mark a bad day, um, anything like that, I, I had to get them. So then on to the holiday ones. I did get the Santa chimney scene. I thought this would be super adorable for marking Christmas Eve. I just, I love it. So much detail, it's so cute. And even if I only get to use this once a year, so worth it. I got the reading by the fireplace sticker. Again, so much detail like on the mantle and things like that. I got the holiday movie cuddles. I love that there's something different on each TV. I got the winter deco sheet. These ones were, are super cute. They would have been super good for that snow day week, but I didn't have them adorable. Then I got the holiday doodle deco. Again, just some nice staple ones to have. I got the holidays with you. Again, another super cute sheet. This is one of her new ones. Um, and I just, I thought this was super great, especially since our it's our first Christmas together. And then I did get the Holiday Shopping Madness 2.0. This is a really good one. And then lastly, the Holiday Burnout. Um, I, just, I think it's cute, especially like this help with wrapping gifts. It's super cute. So that's what I got from One More With Love. And then next I did take advantage of Caress Press during her um, bundle, like Misfit bundle release for foil. Um, I didn't take advantage of the like random pole kits um, just because I, let me just back out a little bit. Um, I like to, I'm a little selective with my kits. So I did end up getting the perfect foil in silver, hollow, and rose gold. So I will go through, I'm going to open these. Um, real quick and then we'll go through them okay so let's go through the five packs first this first one is silver so I got the header overlays these are like silver fall header overlays the like decorative full box overlays these ones are super pretty like a nice um, ornate floral design the half box overlays in the Disney and then the bottom washi for the fall so that was silver um, then we have the hollow probably a couple of these I might be passing on because I don't know if I'll ever use hollow for a fall spread um, but I should never say never um, so same thing the headers the decorative fall full box overlays, that floral pattern, the Disney half box, and then that bottom washi. And then the rose gold here, we have the heart checklist and bow checklist sheet. So they're just long strips. The, this is like a kind of dust overlay, if you can see it. And then bow, um, half box overlays and then the like more plain half box overlays. I've never used half box overlays so we'll see about those as well. Um, and then we have this might have been a, a mystery kit oversock so it has um, let's see these are header overlays they're like the bow confetti yeah those are header overlays. Um, oh god go back and then full box overlays her bottom washi this has a quote box that says let the party begin and then it has some scripts here some corners and just like a little decorative flag so that'll be useful um because i think in my i don't know if i would do that but i have a birthday kit that is more these tones so that would work well with that then i did get to the gold the gold was a 10 piece um so first we have these coffee um, it has like a coffee quote and it has the bows, full box overlays, um, some corner or 
hole reinforcers. These are the bow design. More hole reinforcers. Um, and then another sheet of hole reinforcers. Then we have the hearts and bow checklists. Um, two sheets of the half wax overlays. We have the bow design and then the more simple confetti design. Then we have the bow bottom washi overlay. And then I think this is again another um, mystery kit overstock. This paper is weird. Um, it's very thick. <laughs> So I don't know how to describe this pattern. It's just like an ornate kind of lacy pattern, but the glitter headers are kind of more plain, bottom washy, um, quote box, and then some quote or some scripts there. So that was the gold and those were the perfect bundles. And I didn't even, I got two of the misfit bundles, but I, I didn't see anything on any of these. So. I'm just gonna go through, this is two bundles. Um, so we have some hollow hole reinforcers, some silver, just plain line overlays, the hollow star full box overlays. Um, these are full box overlays? Yeah, so it's like two bougie boxes almost, and then um, two full box overlays in silver. Gold. Um, heart and bow checklists. These are awesome. The rose gold numbers and the silver numbers. Then we have more gold bow or hole reinforcers. Then we have this hollow bottom washi, which I love this like string light pattern almost. And it says when life gives you lemons, um, grab vodka and call the girls. So that's super cute. If you guys can see, it's a sparkly hollow. I think it goes with this. No, I don't know. Kind of looks like it. But this is headers and full box overlays. And this is the second one. So this is gold, like polka dot confetti overlays. Um, the heart and bow checklists. Hollow page reinforcers, um, some more of those two bougie boxes, two overlay boxes in rose gold, more silver, the more of the star hollow full boxes. Yeah, this one is misfit because there was like some ink or something. Um, and this is gold star boxes, rose gold half box overlays, gold star bottom washi, and then one more of these little bottom washi and the sparkly hollow. So that was everything from the grab bags from Cross Press. The last thing is the Cross Press Cyber Monday Mystery Kit. If you're not interested and you don't want to be spoiled, um, X out now. And thank you guys for watching. But I'm going to do a countdown. Three, two, one. Okay, so I did take advantage and get the Cross Press Cyber Monday Mystery Kit. I love her kits um, and her artwork is always good. I do really want to subscribe to her mystery kit. I have not yet, but hoping to do that. So it comes with this little planner stack die cut, which is a vinyl sticker and it is super cute. It does come with a foil bundle and this is um, the header overlays, some decorative pieces. These are like fancy label overlays maybe. Um, some foiled icons here, weekend banner. The eight full box overlays, um, bottom washi. Oh my God, this is so pretty. And uh, some scripts, hole reinforcers and flags. Oh my God, this is great. I love it. So pretty and it's in sparkly hollow. It also came with the 15 millimeter washi and it's in this beautiful lavender color. Let me put the full boxes to the front. And this is called Breakfast Club. And it is gorgeous. I ended up going, I think with, I forget which one I did. Um, but it is gorgeous. These full boxes, you have that planner stack here, um, a purple planner with 
like some decorations, a sticker pad, the washi dispenser um, page or like a bag with some pens, the rainbow bagel, um, the switch, the little jacket, and then you have like the whipped cream um, on top of like a shake or something. Then you have these little waffle sandwiches, some Lucky Charms, which I love that, and then like the booths and like the planner stuff on the tables and then more planners here, which I love that. And it's like, you can see like there's a cello with cross press stickers in it. That is so cute. So I just love this. The colors are so fun. This is gonna be great for spring and I'm definitely gonna use it for spring. Um, so many boxes. Uh, and she did actually just reformat her kits are going to be reformatted for 2021, which I'm super excited about. I love all the changes she made. Um, half boxes, um, fancy labels, um, quarter boxes, the bill do some headers, glitter headers, um, patterned washi, the squared boxes, and then some plain little washi strips there the headers and the little things um the sidebar stuff um heart checklist the work boxes class boxes and i do get the glossy i'm thinking about maybe going back to matte um the bottom washi is so good and then an extra full box date covers oh, this is so cute and then the fashion girls which i love 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 i don't know how i'm even gonna decide because these are gorgeous so i'm super excited about the cross press cyber monday mystery kit um super super happy and it's really hard for me to get mystery kits like i said because i'm super like particular about you know like my kits if you know i don't like them it's kind of sometimes you're kind of stuck with them but with Caress Press, I kind of always have faith that I'll love them. So um, so that was everything. I hope you guys enjoyed this massive haul, um, seeing my Black Friday purchases and a couple extra things. Um, I, I probably will not have any more hauls, probably until the first of the year. So I hope you guys don't mind. This is a really, a lot of money is going out for most of us this time of year. So. That is everything. If you guys haven't subscribed, please subscribe already if you're interested and hit that like button. I will see you guys in my next video. Bye. Okay, so I promise this is the last little portion. This actually came in in perfect time. Um, so I'm just gonna throw it into this whole video. So I did get one of the Murdoch Talks little foil bundles and this is, I think she called it Rose Gold Sparkle. Um, so it did come with this gold freebie with the Merry Christmas, Hello Winter, and a couple of deco pieces in gold foil. And this is gorgeous. It's probably, you're probably not going to be able to see how gorgeous this is. Um, so for her bundle, it comes with these, I think these are half cut headers. Yeah, so they're like half cut headers, um, some foiled emojis. I did get an extra sheet of the full box overlays. Um, so I had enough for a full spread and it's just absolutely stunning. Comes with header overlays. This is more of a very chunky um, like confetti design. Comes with bottom washi, the 15 millimeter, uh, millimeter <laughs> strips. And then I do love her scripts. They're nice and thick and easy to read. The cutout icons, circle icons. Oh my God, that's, you. oh my God, it's so good. And then the date numbers, some little check squares, corner boxes, or like corners for boxes, some little deco pieces, and weekend. So that is the last item for this giant haul. I hope you guys enjoyed. I will see you guys in my next video.